26th April 1917 marks a major watershed in the history of the princely state of Hyderabad. Far-sighted Mir Osman Ali Khan of the Asaf Jahi dynasty and the 7th Nizam of Hyderabad signed the Farman, the Royal Charter, to establish Osmania University to serve the cause of education in the region. This is the seventh oldest university in India, one of the first ten in the subcontinent, first in the subcontinent to have Urdu, the local language, as the medium of instruction. Rabindranath Tagore commended the university for choosing Urdu to impart education. History records that during the first 30 years, the university launched the undergraduate, postgraduate and PhD programs. The courses were run in institutions and buildings located near Gun Foundry. In 1928, Mir Osman Ali Khan acquired about 2,500 acres of land from the learned courtesan Malaka Bai Chanda's Adikmet Jagir and transferred it to the university. The university got its present sprawling campus in the year 1934 and the iconic arts college building in pink granite was inaugurated in 1939. The lush green campus with a variety of flora, robust infrastructure, vast playing grounds, modern gymnasium and a swimming pool provides the perfect ambience for holistic development of students. Ever since its inception, Osmania University has been an enduring symbol of a questioning spirit as well as a citadel of higher education. With die-hard commitment, the university has been redefining pedagogies and molding students into critical thinking individuals and making them globally competitive products. Dynamic, modern and highly learner-centered, the university acknowledges all students as valued leaders of tomorrow whose education and success are most paramount to the institution. At Osmania University, academic rigor involves empowering stakeholders with cutting-edge knowledge, thereby strengthening the socio-economic and political fabric of the nation. Osmania University has many firsts to its credit. Bachelor's course in journalism in 1962, master's course in library and information science in 1978, Biomedical Engineering course at undergraduate level in 1982. Today, the university has grown into an institution par excellence with 12 faculties spanning the fields of arts, sciences, social sciences, law, education, engineering, technology, commerce, management, informatics, pharmacy and oriental languages. 53 departments 553 teaching and 1,640 non-teaching staff, the greatest assets of the university. 721 affiliated colleges, 8 campus colleges, 5 constituent colleges, 5 district PG colleges, 17 autonomous colleges, 3.2 lakh students. To facilitate candidates to pursue education in a non-formal setting in the Telangana state and overseas, the Professor G. Ram Reddy Center for Distance Education with 26 undergraduate, postgraduate and diploma courses caters to an average of 10,000 students each academic year. The imposing Osmania University Library atop the small hillock is a treasure trove of knowledge housing more than 6 lakh books, including 6,825 rare manuscripts. It is a haven for bibliophiles. Combining academics with activism, students were in the forefront of the major struggles for a separate statehood of Telangana. The university is devoted to quality in teaching, research and innovation, and to develop leaders who will make a difference to the world. It fosters a culture of continual multidisciplinary and interdisciplinary inquiry and education among all stakeholders. Thus, it leads to the evolution of an education model that focuses on experiential learning and prepares students face the challenges of a rapidly changing world. It has been at the forefront of undertaking path-breaking and seminal research through 15 research centers and institutes. The professor.